Free Buju Banten. Free Buju Banten. Free Buju Banten. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Once again, I welcome you to In the Streets with Big Stone. Today is a very special and important edition of In the Streets. Today marks the 4th of December, which we, you know, 21 days away from Christmas. And also, today is the, that day is the day that they say the world will come to an end. As you know, the mayor and Kalinda is talking about uh, December 21st, 2012, as the world coming to an end. But as we stand before you today on the 4th of December, I already ask the Almighty God to have compassion on our brother Mark Myrie, a.k.a. Bujibantan, to release him from the bandage and the struggles of the oppressors. Let him come home to his people just like our busy signal came home to his people. Gargamel has done great works. He has done great community works. He has done great leadership works with a lot of people, a lot of youth, especially in the Redis Road area, where he actually grew up. The Whitehall Avenue, seeing the Cassava Peace area. All these youths look up to Buja Banton because Buja Banton is an idol not just for them, but the entire Jamaica and the rest of the world. We know he's charged with some charges. We're not the almighty God to cast judgment. But at the same time, we ask the Almighty God to release this artist because we know that he's more powerful outside of prison than locked up behind bars. So to the powers that may, to the judges, to all the jurors that might be working on this case, free up Mark Myri, man. Free up Bujabantan. Send him home to Jamaica to people them. Because we we'll await him with, with open arms. As you know, Mark Myra is a, a Grammy winner. They didn't want to give it to him all these other times, but they chose to give it to him behind bars. Well, it's better late than never, right? He's not a Grammy winner. Let him come home, let him get the chance to go worldwide and do his thing. Sing his great songs that inspired me and inspired the rest of the world. Free up, Mark Myra. And remember, December 21st, I'm said the world at end. Are you prepared? <laughs> I and I is prepared because I believe in only one God, the Almighty God that created all heaven and earth and all people. A lot of folks have hatred in their heart because of a person's skin color. A lot of persons have vindictiveness in their heart because of where a person was actually born. I mean, look at the Gaza, Palestine, and look at Israel, and look at what is happening over there. Some people came in 1948 and says the Almighty God says this land belongs to them and they shove the people to the side. Not Nagosa. You cannot just go somewhere and take things over. Free up the Gaza. Free up the Palestinian people. And make them strive just like how you want to strive. And again, Gaza, we know none of no great weapons of mass destruction. We see how the Palestinian children fight with pebbles, slingshots against these heavy artillery of Israel and America and the rest of the world that support them. We say free up the people, just like how we say free up Gargamel, free up the people. And IMF, free up Jamaica. You know what I say? Look at the people, because guess what? We need it. So, Mama Porsche, salute and you're doing a good job. My cameraman, you're going worldwide, no enough flash, but tell us this one, I got shot. Free up everything.